Although Kobe did sign the basketball and send the picture. Although, uh, say that again. Say that again. Although. Although Kobe signed the picture mm-hmm. and sent it back to you, you guys never actually talked. You guys never actually shook hands, nope. apologized to each other and everything else like that. And then in 2020, uh, Kobe and his daughter, along with some other kids yep. and their parents, uh, died in a helicopter crash. Mm-hmm. I remember it was literally down the street from where I was living in Calabasas. Mm. So it was just a very sad day. Like yeah. we went out there and we walked as far as we could until the police, yeah. you know, lines yeah. basically stopped, stopped us from going. We were there with all the other, you know, Laker fans and yeah. everything just. In disbelief. Just in disbelief. Yeah. In yeah. disbelief. I mean, Kobe took a helicopter everywhere. Yeah. He would take a helicopter to work, you mm-hmm. know, from Orange County to the Staples Center, mm-hmm. back and forth every day. That was just his normal uh, way, way of transportation. Of transportation. I, I believe that day it was he was going to his daughter's training camp, I think, which is in Thousand Oaks. Mm-hmm. And yeah, a bunch of fog, helicopter, didn't see a, a hill, and yeah. the worst wow. possible situation happened. But when you heard about the crash, what'd you think? Uh, I thought it was a hoax at first. Mm. And then when it was uh, um, validated or verified that it wasn't a hoax, that it was real when I started to get it from multiple people. I was actually in church that Sunday morning. I was uh, doing security at my church, and uh, you know it was the end of service, and somebody walked up to me and showed me a text. And they said, uh, the headline said, you know, Kobe dies in a helicopter crash. I was like, come on, stop lying. Then somebody else walked up to me, showed me the same thing. And, uh, you know, something that I thought would never happen uh, because of our history. Like, I literally, like, like I fell to my knees. Like, I I couldn't stand. Like, my, I got weak in the knees. Like, so, uh, a grown man had to pick me up and walk me to the back because I couldn't walk. Like, I, it, really, it really just took everything out of me. And... uh I, uh, me saying it now, somebody would be like, you're lying. But honestly, it, uh, it affected me in a way that I, I wouldn't even believe that it did. Well, yeah. I mean, think about how many people were crying and, you know, falling apart who never even met Kobe, who probably never even seen him play yeah. in person, just watched him on TV. Mm-hmm. You actually played with him side by side. Yeah. And regardless of your differences. Yeah. Exactly. You know, a certain portion of your success came from playing with him. Mm-hmm. Just is what it is. Yes, sir. And you guys did have some level of relationship, even though it wasn't that close. Mm-hmm. You guys were basically soldiers on the on the battlefield side by side. Side by side. And that's what I chucked it up to. You know? Yeah, sad day, man. Sad day. And then, you know, just recently, they actually unveiled the first of three Kobe statues. And you're actually in town for that? Yeah, I was in town for that. Yeah. One of three, so there's gonna be three of them. It's gonna be three of them. Okay. Yeah. All right. And uh, I Are guess they... some people were talking about the poses, and his <laughs> wife was like, "He chose this pose." So mm-hmm. if y'all don't like it, tough shit. Yeah. <laughs> this Listen, was something he was playing everybody's for. gonna have an opinion. Everybody's yeah. not gonna like, you know, everything. Some people are gonna like it. Some people are not gonna like it. You know, you can't please everybody. So, so you were there during the actual unveiling? Uh, no. 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 Why not? Um. <laughs> uh, my uh, passport got revoked. I'm joking. No, um, it was, <laughs> so it was no, I, I, came, I came into town to, you know, uh, just to, you know, pay my respects to, you know, see the Kobe revealing, but the uh, the invitations were limited, so there wasn't enough space. All right, fair enough. Yeah. I mean, there's been a lot of Lakers, yeah. especially with how long his career has been mm-hmm. on that team. Uh, there's yeah, a lot of people to invite. Yeah, of course. Plus uh, the other NBA legends who didn't who played against him. Yeah, and, yeah, yeah no, I mean, and the way I fall on the hierarchy of you know yeah. priority list, you know, I know I'm on a, the the bottom of the totem pole. I get it. Well, you're still on the totem but, pole, but I'm, but I'm here. But you're still on the totem pole. I, I'm here. I though. can't say that. <laughs> <laughs> I have no authentic ability. 